Hello, everybody. Hope you're all doing good. How is everybody doing? Ethan, Caden, Caleb, Back East Baseball, Lemons, RJ, Sean, Sawman, Pro Gamer, HDJ. We got Gavin. We got Chandler. We got Northeastern Whitetail Hugs. We got Super Youper. We got Nugget. We got Nick. We got Ethan. We got another Ethan. We got Silas. We got the Call of Duty Master, Leroy, Nate's a great. How's everybody doing? Hey, Bullseye, Archie, Brooks. How's everybody doing? Apologies if I missed everybody. There's a lot of names to read off. Hope you're all doing great, though. Let's start out with a little bit of New England bird hunting with the brand new pupper. Let's see if we can level this doggo up a little bit more. And I think after that, we're going to continue our roe deer grind a little bit. Because uh, this will carry over to the live build. The last couple updates, EW's been using our live save game instead of a, like a secondary one for these early accesses. So we do get to keep all the progress from this. Which means we can shoot some roe deer and not have to worry about it uh, not carrying over. That's nice. But of course, we're going to do a couple hours of the dog first. Try to get some levels on it. There he is. Or there she is. I keep forgetting that I chose a uh, female dog this time. Good old Charlie over here. Come here. Come on, Charlie. Come on. Be a good pupper. Come over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're doing great already. Come on. Over here. Over here. Are you stuck on the tree? Who's stuck on the tree? You are. Well, this is going great. Adam, thank you for the 28 months, man. And J6, thank you for the three months. Thank you so much to the both of you. Absolutely incredible. Oh, now you come at Wow. Okay. Okay. Now you walk out. Okay, there you are. Look at you. I like the charcoal variant so much. So good looking. Let's play with Charlie real quick. Level 7 on tracking and level 13 overall. Just like a real dog. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. It's like, they don't listen until you don't need them to listen anymore. Then they're like, okay, now I'll do it. We're good. Let's do... Uh, let's back up and do a little praise right there. All right, let's go to our duck setup and start smoking them. Let's see if we can get some good luck with the ducks today. Hey, Cole, how's it going, man? I wouldn't listen to Crow either. True, Ben, true. How you doing, man? Hope you're doing good. Oh, you didn't miss too much, Corey. We just started. We just started everything up. Now, let's see what we got here. Okay, so let's do teal. Because we've already got the uh, the golden eye decoys down. Alright, I'm going to need you to lay down real quick. Stay right there. Oh, that got a level up. We're almost to level 15, man. We're so close. Just a few more retrieves and we should be there, I imagine. What are my thoughts on the new Labrador Retriever? So far, I think it's pretty good, but could use some work in some areas. Overall, it's going to be a solid addition to any bird hunting uh, expedition, but they need to work on the pathing a little bit more. That kind of looks a little bit different. Is that a rare? That bird looked a little bit different. I could be completely wrong, but I think it looked different. Uh, let's see. Go get that one over there. You got this, Charlie. I believe in you. I believe in you, buddy. Go get it. Oh. Oh. You found it. There we go. Good job. Good job, Charlie. 
What a good doggo. Now, should be going to get more, I think. Yeah, searching around for more. Although... Yeah, there you go. Did you get a rare or what might be a rare? I'm not sure. I think it could be. I don't think that's the one that she grabbed, though. I'm not 100% sure. I'll have to see in a second. Oh my gosh, you're going far. Okay, there's nothing over there. I promise you. I promise you there's nothing over there. To be fair, I sent you over there knowing there was nothing else floating. I was kind of trying to get her to pick that up, but I guess it's too close. Hey, Croc Slayer, just testing out the new dog. It's, uh, it's working out pretty good so far. The animations for swimming are amazing, though. Like, that's one of my favorite things so far. The swimming animations are really, really good. Alright, let's try to get her to go over there. We'll see how that works. Go get it! Thank you. Look at that wake, that's what I'm saying. Just zooming. Don't see any more ducks though. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Oh, those are mallards though. Those are mal- <laughs> You having fun? You having fun there, buddy? Do we have any more out here? Well, I guess uh, time will tell. Anything over there? If so, go get it. What gun do I use? This is the 12 gauge pump action shotgun, the uh, the Cacciatore. It's a really good shotgun. You know, it requires being able to hit the duck for them to uh, be recovered by our doggo. But it is what it is. <laughs> No, we're not Great One Grinding today because uh, we don't currently have a Great One Grind that we need to do for the week. We got the dog stuff. Obviously, there's no bird Great One, so not going to go for a Great One there. And we're doing Roe Deer for the next few days because that's what people voted for was Roe Deer. People voted for Roe Deer over all the Great One species, so... We got a few more days of Roe Deer, then we'll be back to a Great One Grind after that, most likely. Or something like that, at least. We'll figure it out. Hey, good job. Working out pretty good. Now, I'm not going to claim these yet because I kind of want to see a giant pile of them. Thank you. <laughs> Dropped it right there. More mallards. Man, I need to set up some mallard decoy here. Oh. Don't want to grab that. Can I get out of my blind, please? There we go. Perfect, man. Let's get some decoys. Where's Mallard decoy? There we go. I need to buy some more of the Drake ones. Oh gosh, where are they? I don't even know. Oh gosh, hey. How did that one miss? <laughs> we got that one though. Go get it. Go get it, Popper. What side do I use on the shotguns? That is the Red Raptor Reflex sight. It's in the handgun category, but it fits on shotguns as well. In a case of the duck aim, I do this time. What the? Landed right in here. That's incredible. 
<laughs> Our dog is having a heyday right now. Going crazy. No, we haven't got anything yet, uh, Kristoff. We pretty much just started. Average kill count for a minor HM grind where you just don't shoot the twos. Uh, for Fallow. I average kill count anywhere from 500 to 1500, but again, that's just average. It could be much more. It could be much less. It can, uh, it can go back and forth. Oh, we got level 15. So how long command or run farther away and search for someone to retrieve? Yes, that's much better. So that's going to be very, very helpful. Okay, so that is a duck that we can't claim. Alright, go ahead and uh, take a little rest. Take a rest, you need it. Let's uh, praise as well. CG, thank you for the 30 months, dude. 30 months is crazy. Approaching three years as a member, man. That's wild. Later, Corey. Can the dogs pick up turkeys? Yes, they can. If you uh, watch the video that I posted this morning, at the very end of it, I have the dog uh, recover a turkey. It was pretty cool. I did not expect them to be able to pick up a turkey. All right, let's let's uh, let's play with our dog a little bit to keep the uh, focus up. Or not focus, the uh, bond. Gotta keep that uh, bond up. Make sure we're bonding with our pupper so she'll retrieve these ducks better. Oh. I hear something. Is that just the collar? I can't tell. Wait, no, I definitely hear one. Where, though? It, they gotta be through the trees. Okay, I wanna try something real quick. I wanna go over here and then make our dog take the entire pile of ducks over here. I think that could be kinda cool to get all the ducks, like, right here in front of us. Just to kind of see if she'll do it. Hey, Dalton, how's it going, man? Hey, Foxy. Can you not recover ones that you've already gone for? Maybe. Oh, no, there we go. Okay, so she can grab the ones that have already been brought over and move them to a different spot if you want her to. That's pretty cool. Now, go get the others. Thank you. <laughs> That's amazing. That is so cool. That might actually be a great way to level your dog up. Yeah, that actually might be the way to level up quickly. Just have her repeatedly retrieve the same birds. That might be a crazy way to level things up quickly. Yeah, we just got a level there. Level 16 on the companion level. That's cool. Nice, Cyclops. That's awesome, dude. I'm doing good, Lucas. I'm doing very, very good. Yeah, the ducks have kind of stopped coming in. I'm just going to have our dog pile them all up so that I can get a, a cool screenshot of all the ducks on top of each other. That is such a sick animation, too, of putting the duck down. Look at all those ducks. Here she comes with another one. That's so cool. Ooh, that was a good picture. Okay, let's praise. Good job. Good job, pupper. You got this. I, I know you're worn out, but you got this. What is the best spot for Tundra Bean Goose? 
Uh, there's a lot of good spots, like, in the middle of the map. I think the north as well. Or is it just gray legs in the top? I, I can't remember. I know the middle's really good, though. Score two surprise diamonds from Rev. Max score max weight hair and Canada goose. Nice, Foxy. That's awesome. Congrats on that. Okay, so I guess that's all of them. No, there's more over there. Probably just tired, so doesn't want to go back over. Sam, thank you for the 18 months. Where am I at on the map? I'm right here. This little J Lake here on New England Mountains. There, now she's getting the rest. Perfect. You gonna get another? This is pretty sick. We got a whole uh, pile up now. Coming back with another one. Having fun in the water, too. What is the best goose? Ah, uh, whichever one you like the most. That's really all it comes down to. Whichever one you like the most is the best goose. Alright, is she getting more? Yep. Going back to get that one, I assume. <laughs> that is so good. I really like the animations. Thank you. You are leveling up nicely. Now, is there any more? Got any more or are you good? Alright, let's do a quick little check. See if there was any missed because I want to get a screenshot of all of them on top of each other. I think that's it, though. Yep, she got them all. She has got them all. No, the new dog cannot track. Only retrieving. Alright, let's line her up for a screenshot. And yes, you can push them around just like you could the other dog. To get that perfect picture. There we go. That's pretty cool. We got a bunch of them lined up like that. 1152 is not bad for Goldeneye. Uh, 767 on that one. We got a, another female, another female, another female, another female, and another female. Hey! What was that? <laughs> that was interesting. Oh my gosh. Uh... Thank you, JC. That's actually perfect. There we go. Um, the lab can retrieve all class one animals. Uh, uh, Kyron, is it Kyron or Kieran? What, whatever it is. Apologies if I got your name wrong. Uh, but yeah, it can recover every class one animal. That includes uh. Ducks, geese, turkeys, rabbits, capercallies, all the upland birds. Can recover all of them. Which is pretty nice. Alright, Pepper, you can lay down. How about that? You can lay down. What is wrong with my blind? Uh... Okay, now it's now it's fixed. That was weird. What is my best goose? I don't know to be honest. I am not 100% sure. I'd have to go back and look at every goose that I've got. Well, hello there little guys. Golden eyes. Beautiful. No, you can only have one dog out at once. 
Uh, if you had two out, it would conflict with the like control wheel too much. The command wheel. Hey, VR Turtle, how's it going? Hope you're doing good, man. Ender, what's up, man? Ooh, three down. Can we get a fourth? Oh, no way. It's turning now. We're not getting that one. Go get him. It's right next to you as well. <laughs> so that makes it easy. Oh, hi, other turtle. How's it going? It says searching to retrieve, but she's just laying there. Okay. There she goes. Right there. Come on. Oh, there she goes. Zooming. Finally zooming over. What lake am I hunting? Right here. The J Lake. This is where I've been doing most of my hunting here uh, on New England. Well, we got a good bit of them. Ow. All right, well, that one missed. Where's our dog now? Right next to us, okay. So in that case, go over there. CJ, oh, what's up, dude? Hey, the realist scout, scout quo. <laughs> Sorry about it. Your pal came around. Down to game tomorrow. All right, perfect, CJ. Perfect, dude. That works out. That works. What is tomorrow anyway? Tomorrow's Saturday. Yeah, tomorrow is normally a day that I don't stream, but I might stream anyway because of the dogs. Oh, don't look, guys. Don't look. You'll go blind. Oh, don't turn on me. Come on. Just going to stare at the ground the rest of the day. We'll probably have better luck shooting that way. Where'd she go? Is she still over there? She's still over there. All right, well, let's just claim all these. Hey, where is this one that... There it is. Nice. Love to see it. Bringing us some more. Oh, smoked it. Go get it. Good job, pupper. Duck aim, literally. Literally. Was grinding on Revel and Thule. Don't get bucks. How can I solve that? You just got to find their zones, N2. You're going to have the same amount that anybody else will. Just about finding where they are. That's really all it comes down to. Just figuring out where your zones are. So just go to the drink time for them. And then check all of the water. And you will end up eventually finding them. Just a matter of time, you know? Not something that happens instantly. Gotta spend some time figuring out where they are. Sometimes a few hours, sometimes it takes a few days. A little bit different for everybody.
Don't know if I even got close to one on that last shot. It's pretty good, CJ. There's a few issues, but for the most part, it's pretty good. The biggest issues I've ran into is like some pathing issues if the birds land in weird places. But I guess that's kind of to be expected. Like, uh, I had a bird land on a cliffside above me, and the dog couldn't claim it. Or couldn't, uh, recover it for me. Same with, uh, I got a goose to land on the dock, and it wouldn't grab that. But, like, those are really, like, unconventional places to land, so I would imagine that's not too big of a deal. It's not like you're gonna run into those situations that often. Overall, they're pretty fun, though. They, they have really good animations, and it is a massive time saver when you're, uh, when you're bird hunting. Hey, little feller. Ooh, smoked it. All right, go get that one. Got to level you up as much as we can. Tyron, how's it going, man? Nice, Mitchell. That's awesome, dude. I was really good, uh, TP fishing. It was really good. Had a lot of fun yesterday on Thanksgiving. Did not mean to fall out there. Tyron, thank you for the two months, dude. Much appreciated. Love you, Crow. Thank you so much, dude. Right back at you. Appreciate all y'all watching the channel, as always. First animal on Rancho was a... Uh... Okay, I already read that. Never mind. No, not all dogs will be able to retrieve only the retriever. Because that's its uh, purpose in the game. Just like the Bloodhound, it will be the only one that can track because that's its purpose in the game. There will not be a dog that can do both as far as I know. Uh, maybe one of these days, uh, Bullseye. We'll have to see if time zones can ever allow us to do it. That's been the toughest thing. The dog can only retrieve? Yes, that's that's what it's for. It's a retriever. Not a, If every dog could do everything in the game, there'd be no reason to add other dogs into the game. Like, if every dog could retrieve and track at the same time, there'd be no reason to have, like... Both the Bloodhound and the Retriever. It'd be like you'd get one and then you'd never buy another dog ever again. Uh, yeah, had uh, Hendrick. I've got tons of guides on it that you can check out on the channel. I've got a Herd Management Guides playlist. Got all of it in one area for you. Should be the best place to go to get all the HM info in one place. Smoking those little ducks. So we're at level 19, about to hit level 20. That's actually pretty quick leveling, to be honest. I've played maybe an hour and a half with the dog. And we've already got it pretty high level. That's pretty wild. So what do we have here? Dog is naturally more willing to work and has increased focus. If idle, your dog will go into heal position when you fire, fire your weapon. So that'll make it so that whenever you fire your weapon, it'll like uh, kind of hunker down a bit to not spook off the, uh, the ducks in the area. But I feel like increased focus is better because it'll make it so the dog is better at retrieving. Like it'll be more likely to listen to your commands. It'll be more likely to uh, not get tired as quickly and stuff like that. 
That's definitely going to be very good. What's up, Chessy? Hope you're doing good. Hey, Yolandra. Uh, you didn't miss too much. Just a, a few ducks going down here and there. Ooh, there's a bunch. There's a bunch right there. Bunch of mallards. They're pretty high up. I don't want to take a... Sh Actually, I'm about to move locations anyway, so let's go. Yep, kind of figured that's how it would end, but we're moving anyway. Hey, Mitchell, how's it going? That makes it worth getting. Yeah, it levels up really quickly. And uh, it retrieves birds very fast as well. Yeah, I can't believe they can retrieve turkeys either, Johnny. That's pretty incredible. But I am all for it, man. I am all for it. Because that is hilarious. Alright, let's lay down, buddy. Also, good job. Praise the pupper. Oh, here they come. Hey, Greatest Showman, how's it going? This area is set up for teal and mallard. Ooh, we could get these. I don't want to wait for them to come down, though. Because if we wait for some of them to land, we could get a lot of them right here. No, you can't do the Bloodhound and Retriever at the same time. It's one or the other. And I imagine that's for, like, ease of use, because if you had both out, it would be very, uh, weird using, like, the command wheel and stuff. It probably wouldn't work too well. Oh my gosh, no. Dude, stop zigzagging, man! Just let me shoot you! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Stupid ducks, man. <laughs> Maybe no sight would be better. Yeah, that's a lot more snappy. Wow, it went into the no-kill mode right after I got the first one. I have no clue, uh, Froish. I don't play in any of the... All the wild games on console, so I have no clue if it runs better on PC or console. Not a clue. Where's the first duck? Did she even grab it? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's right there. It just blends in so well. Boom. There we go. Now we wait for more. Hey, Hi Riser, how's it going? Are bicolor tarm again rare? No, that's a common. Oh no, Johnny. R.I.P. R.I.P. man. Oh well, it happens. You know, if they say it is what it is. Gosh, the redirectioning they're doing is crazy. That was also a crazy shot we just hit. Best way to get money? Uh, there's a lot of ways. Um... I would recommend watching my no DLC playthrough that I've got. I've been doing some money-making methods in the last few episodes. A lot of those are pretty good. Red deer are good. Crocs are good. Rooster deer are good. Black bear are good if you can get them working well. There's lots of ways to make money that are pretty good.
All right, what do we got here? Golden eyes, of course. So that means they're not going to land here because I don't have any golden eye decoys out. Maybe I should go get some. <laughs> I took it before I could put it down. <laughs> That's great. Do we have any? No, I gotta buy them. Gotta buy some again. There we go. Hey, little guys. You gonna land? There's so many flying around. Holy crap, man. My gosh. What the? How? Explain! Holy crap, why are you whining now? What's happening? What? Why are you upset? That was a lot of upset puppy! Alright, let's set this up. What do you mean open space? There is open space there. There we go. Yeah, the Labrador! Woof woof. Now lay down. Good pupper. A solo golden eye. What are you guys? Those are golden eye as well. That's better. A lot more golden eye there. Hold on. While we're waiting for them to go down, I feel like this is really throwing me off. I feel like I need to go to small reticle size and. Go back to something like this. I feel like that's a lot better. Holy crap, there's so many. There's so many. Oh, gosh. Dude, stop turning. Oh, my gosh. Did they just add that? I swear they didn't turn like that before. I swear the ducks didn't zigzag like that before. That's crazy. Oh, really, hunting gods? That's hilarious. How do we miss those shots, man? Makes no sense. I've never seen the ducks zigzag like that. Maybe it's because I usually don't let them get defensive and spook off. But that was crazy. Look at that Thanksgiving. Oh, the Thanksgiving copper. Yeah, it looks so good. It looks so clean on the shotgun. Guys, tell me now and be honest. Is it just me or do the ducks seem to zigzag more? Like, that was kind of crazy how he was just zigzagging back and forth trying to get away. I've never seen them do that before. It might just be because I don't hunt birds that often. And when I do, I typically shoot them before they get a chance to even go defensive. So, could be it. Swifty, thank you for the super sticker. Much appreciated. Thank you for that. Hope you're doing good. We got more over here. Yeah, I'm going to go back to what I was doing last time. Shoot them way before they get a chance to land. Because I feel like that's what's screwing it up. Oh, 
Oh, gosh, I'm just bad today. What level is she? Up to 20. We got her to 20 now. You think they should add Komodo dragons? I don't know if those are legal to hunt. I have no clue. Another one. No diamond or rare mallard yet. No male spawning on my row on two just been bow hunting some random Canada geese and female mallard that come through. Hey, gotta do what you gotta do to keep it entertaining, right? Am I just not leading it properly? I feel like maybe I need to lead more. Your cinnamon teal and parquet do it? Got you. Must just be the fact that I never hunt birds. Okay, that was a little better. No clue, Keeper moving. No clue, man. They haven't talked about any great ones. There is no great one in this update, and it's looking like it'll be a while before we get one. Unfortunately. No clue, Aiden. Kind of just whenever. Whenever I feel like it, essentially. I don't really have a time frame for anything today. Just hunting and trying to enjoy the uh, the new update, figure out what's going on with it and stuff like that. Come on, little fellers. Loop around a little closer. Good job. Good job, pupper. Now go get the rest. There's a million more where that one came from. What's the best map for money? Uh, Emerald, probably. I would say Emerald Coast. Heal there. The reason I say Emerald is primarily because of that little northern spot and also just Crocs are great, Rusa are great, they've got Red Deer on there which are also great for money. Three down, love to see it. Thank you Popper, thank you. Just bringing them over here like crazy. That's probably my favorite thing, is that sometimes you only need to tell it to retrieve once. And then it's just constantly getting ducks for you. Like, I only told it to go there once and it brought four ducks over. And now there's more over here that she's bringing. That's amazing. So yeah, that's going to be a pretty big time saver for recovering things. 100% going to get this. It's definitely going to be a good DLC if you duck hunt a lot. I don't do a ton of bird hunting, so I don't know how often I'm going to use the retriever. But that is strictly just because I don't do a lot of bird hunting. But anytime that I do hunt birds, I'm 100% using it. Does the dog spook the birds? Yes, so dogs will spook birds and small game, but they will not spook stuff like deer or bears or anything like that. I think that goes for all dogs, if I'm not mistaken. Well, we got one of them. 
I mean, you got there, buddy. Having fun hopping around, eh? Doing a hop and a skip and a jump. Love to see it. That last one we got was over here, right? I think so. Well, if there's something over there, she'll get it. Do I have a leucistic plains bison? Yes, I think I do. I might be wrong, but I think I do. Nice, VR turtle. Ah, uh, maybe, Johnny. How deep of water can the dog go in? Any depth. I've seen the dog be able to go in every depth of water. Doesn't seem to matter uh, how deep it is. So what do you guys think? Should we go for a turkey hunt with the dog real quick? After she uh, gets those. Oh, you guys want to? Okay. We'll have to do it then. We will have to do it then, man. Gotta let her retrieve all of these, though. Get the XP. Light green, female teal. Now, get the others. There's more. Come on. I believe in you. Thank you. Thank you, Popper. We're at level 23 on uh, companion level. Now, there should be another over there, I think. I might be wrong, but I think there's more over there. I don't know if we'll do SRP for the turkeys. Oh, what the? Right there? Okay. Okay. Well, that's all of them then. Yeah, they level super, super quick. Like, really quick. Um... There should be turkeys over here, right? I think turkeys are in the north. I believe they are. Latent turkeys? Uh, maybe. I'd be afraid to accidentally delete some of my moose or whitetail zones, though. Because I get kind of crazy when I'm hunting birds. I just start shooting everything in sight. Let's see if we can find a turkey. <laughs> well, that's a turkey right there. Aha! Our first turkey of the day! So it should be right about here. Let's see if our dog will be able to recover that from that far away. She's stuck. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hopping him. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, that was great. Come on. Come on down. You got this. I believe. I believe you can collect them all. This isn't even Pokemon, but you can catch them all. Oh, 
Holy crap, she's... She's zooming! Look at the little zoomy! She's zooming! Going all the way around! Just to get down to us. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty cool. Yeah, there she is. Now go get him. Oh, going straight for the turkey, I think. Oh, she grabbed the duck first. She grabbed the duck first. She'll get the turkey eventually. I believe. I believe. Thank you. Now go get the others. Grabbing that duck now. Oh yeah, the, the retriever is super quick. Super, super speedy. Now go get the turkey. Go get the turkey. You know you want to. There you go. There you go. Uh, it's in the description of all my videos, Hendrick. Yeah, I know, TP. We'll get some later. Returning with harvest. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you, uh... You having trouble with that, or are you good? <laughs> That's incredible. Hold, hold up. I, I gotta see that again. I gotta see that again. I gotta see that again. Now retrieve. Thank you. <laughs> That's amazing. So, dog recovering turkeys is officially the greatest thing in the Hunter Call of the Wild. That was amazing. <laughs> Last one was like over here, I think. Go find me that last duck. I believe in you. Appreciate it, David. There was white tail here. Here was me. Couldn't find anything, huh? Yeah, so there is a range in which they can retrieve. If uh, there's nothing within that range, they won't grab it. I think our duck's like further over here, now that I think of it. Let's try this now. Yeah, it's pretty crazy to think about, Caitlin. It just shows how weird the scaling is here in the Hunter. Zooming over there. Stop zigzagging, bro. Not cool. Oh, gosh. Scared the crap out of me. Let's find some rabbits and turkeys to retrieve, actually. Because we can find a bunch of rabbits and have the dog uh, recover those. That'll be kind of cool as well. Well, there's the duck. Go get it. Go get it. And there she goes. She found our duck finally. What map is that? This is New England Mountains. 413 Teal. We're almost to level 25 on the dog as well. Let's do... This actually should level it up. Let's just uh, sit. 
Lay down. Stay. Heal. Stay. Say it. Does that do anything? No. Okay, so I guess it's uh, leveled up too much from those at the moment. There's got to be some type of diminishing returns, because I know for a fact that our doggo was leveling up from that earlier. Actually, it might have gone up a little bit, but I guess it wasn't much. Yeah, you can buy treats for them as well. I didn't, just because... Eh, it is what it is. Hold on, you don't need to retrieve anything right now. Just follow me. Follow me, pupper. We're going to find some pheasants. We're going to find some cottontails. We're going to find some turkeys. And we're going to take them down and have you grab them. Uh, yeah, Andy. It was pretty good. A fun Thanksgiving as always. Where is this little rabbit? Where is it? I don't even see the tracks from it, man. No tracks at all. Well, we got a deer. That's not going to work, though. I can't I can't have the dog recover a deer, sadly. I don't know where this rabbit went. Oh, well, we'll keep looking. I don't know, Johnny. Very interesting. <laughs> One day, no diamond in the anger. I'm going inside insane. Unfortunately, man, you'll get it eventually. Things will pick up. I promise. True, Caitlin, true. Um, only small game are farming. As with all the dogs, it's the same. They spook small game, but they don't uh, spook a uh, big game. We just got a level. Your dog has a higher chance of staying close to you. Your dog swims faster. Yes, the webbed paws perk. Let's go. Boom. Faster swimming doggo. Love to see it. And then the last one we'll get is this one. Your dog retrieves at longer distances and, in, and is less burdened by carrying harvests. So that'll be a really good one to go for once we hit level 30. Man, these dogs level up really quick. I feel like this is faster than uh, the Bloodhound. I could just be misremembering because it's been so long since I've leveled up a Bloodhound. This seems really quick, man. Go get it. Go get it. Go get the little rabbit. Go get it. Uh, yeah, Corbin, I do have a Discord server. The link is in the description of the stream, as well as all the videos. And also, if uh, if needed, the moderators can bring up a link in the chat for it. Oh, oh my. Oh, oh my gosh. It's covering up my dog's entire face. <laughs> Thank you for the rabbit. Even though that looked uh, really derpy. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was beautiful. Yeah, definitely, Zachy. Like, there's a lot of them that are quite uh, interestingly scaled. I think it's primarily because of the way, like, the height of the character model. Like, our character models are really small compared to the animals if you line them up. And uh, because of that, they have to make the dog smaller to, like, make it look realistic from our player's perspective. But then when you put the animals next to the dog, it's like, okay, 
That's, uh, that's not scaled right. So I feel like they'd have to completely redo the character model and, like, change, like, the, the height of the camera and stuff like that. I play PC, uh, Apex Strip, bruh. Uh, yes, our farming, they do. They show up in the lodge just like the Bloodhound does. Oh, turkey track. Oh, we got turkey tracks. Okay. Do I like New England more now? Uh, it's kind of the same as it's always been for me. I like it for birds and small game, but I don't like it for anything else. But because we're hunting a lot of birds and small game, we're hunting on New England more. Let's catch up to these things. Yes, I have been IRL hunting. It's been a while, but I hunted IRL a few times when I was a kid. Dorky tracks, indeed. We're going to track them down. Hopefully drop them to the ground. That's a bear. Definitely not what we're after. Could you imagine our dog just like dragging a bear to us? <laughs> just dragging a bear over here. That'd be amazing. Definitely, Johnny. Yes, exactly. 100%. For real, for real. Where's the turkeys? I, I would have thought that we would have at least got a uh, warning call if we were close. So I guess we're not close yet. That's a big boy moose track. So happy they're getting added. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I think if you're a, a bird and small game hunter, this is going to be a necessity. But if you don't really hunt them, then they don't really have too much of a purpose aside from looking adorable. But yeah, if you hunt birds a lot, this is going to be a great option. Hey, edits for friends. Uh, we're not really into a grind yet. The uh, the row grinding will come later. We're just uh, shooting any type of class one animal that pops up in front of us so this dog can recover it. Been working out pretty good so far. Got a lot of animals down. Almost got the dog to level 30 as well. We're at level 25. What is the most hunted spot on Leighton Lakes? It depends on the species you're going for. And to be honest, it differs a little bit from each person's map to another person's map. Because of the fact that there's not a, there's not like a guarantee that they're all going to have the same uh, zones. Yes, level 30 is max level. We're super close to getting max level on the dog already. After only a couple hours of gameplay, which is pretty wild. I did an hour to make the video this morning, and then I've done an hour here on the stream. And yeah, it's not taken that long to level the dog up. And I was hoping that this little clearing right here would have something... Was really hoping these clearings would have more. Oh, that's a moose right there. That's not exactly what we're looking for, though. That's a big four. I don't have anything to shoot bigger animals with. I only have uh, class one weapons with me, I think. Yeah, I just have the 22 Hornet and the Cachatori. Hello there, white-tailed deer. Where could we go for turkey and, you know, I kind of want to go for pheasant as well. Kind of want to try to get a pheasant. I think if we start here and we go north, that might be good. Because then we'll start in pheasant territory and kind of move into turkey territory. And then rabbits are all over, so we'll see how this works. What's time where you are? It's 3.29 p.m. for me. Do you keep your progress in this early access? Yes, we do. This one we do. 
Which is why I'm uh, going to do a little roe deer hunting later, because we are saving progress from this one. Like, the last two, they've let us save progress. It's interesting. They keep going back and forth. Like, for a while, we couldn't. Then we were able to for one, uh, for one DLC. Then we couldn't again. Then last time, last update, we were able to again, and now we still are able to. So I, I don't know which direction they're going to go next. But, uh, yeah, we get to keep the progress this time around. Your SRP is haunted? How did that happen? How did it get haunted, man? Lots of gold and I, but they are not what we're after right now. Lots of white tail as well. New Emerald Mountains, England coast. Yes, def definitely. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Ooh, R.I.P. Zaki. Feels bad, man. Yeah, maybe, Newt. Yeah, that's right, Johnny. Those ones. Oh. Come here, little bunny. Come here, little bunny. I got a shotgun for you. There he is. Go get it. Go get it. Good job. Okay, that looks better. That one's not uh, as strange looking as the last rabbit he grabbed. That was actually pretty clean. That looks good. I guess we had like a one-off thing uh, last time where it just picked it up wrong. Chip, what's up, man? Later, Foxy. What do you think the next great one will be? No clue, man. I hope they uh, venture off of the base map great ones. We'll see, though. I'd love to see, like, a Rocky Mountain Elk or a Mule Deer. So I'm hoping they'll do something like that, but... It's tough to say. How's the pupper? Uh, it's working pretty good. Aside from, like, a couple of pathing issues that I ran into when I was recording this morning. But that was in, like, very strange areas. So, for the most part, it's been pretty good. It's been quite good. You know, I know it says class one only, but let's try it with the raccoon. Why not? Can you grab a raccoon? I know the answer is most likely no, but can you grab it? Show me. Just, just grab it by the tail or something, please. That'd be incredible. <laughs> No, no, it, it definitely can't. Okay, buddy. I got it. Right one Charizard. <laughs> definitely, man. Hey, Jesse, how's it going? I'm not a big fan of Hunting Sim 2, uh, Tyrek, just because of the way the developers abandoned the game. Way before it had, like, any of the issues fixed or improved. How can you grab a turkey but not a raccoon? That's what I'm saying, man. It's strange, man. It's so strange. Like, I like these dogs, but there is some very strange, strange things that don't make sense for what it can pick up and what it can't. 
I feel like the animals are in need of a rework of their classes. Or just change the way the dog picks animals up to make it so that maybe it's based on the size of the animal and not the class. Because, yeah, like, turkeys are pretty massive. Dogs should not be able to grab a turkey, but it should be able to grab a raccoon or a fox. How do you get XP for shotguns? Just use shotguns and you'll get XP for them. All right, we're just going to run north. North-ish. A uh, hunt near water, Asher. That's the best tip I can give you. Hunt near water because animals that are in their drink zones are a lot easier to find. And then take note of what time that animal drinks. That way you'll know exactly when to find them there. Yeah, exactly, Caitlin. Something like that would be much better, I think. I hear a rabbit. Come on, little feller. Where are you? Where is this one? Oh, here we go. Oh, pheasants too. Ooh, we hit it. We hit the pheasant. Not very well, though. It was like one pellet, so it's barely dying at all. You know what? Just so we can get the dog to recover you. There we go. Nice, Mark. That's awesome, man. That is awesome, dude. Thank you for the pheasant, buddy. Good job. That was adorable. <laughs> that was adorable. <laughs> oh, man. Now, yeah, bring me the rabbit. Bring me the rabbit, buddy. Nice. Yeah, the dog's doing pretty good with picking up the rabbits now. I think we just had a little bit of a hiccup there. No, you cannot have both dogs out at once. Just one. Yeah, I know, Johnny. I'm not really planning on using the shotgun too much more, so I didn't really grab the, uh, I didn't really top up the ammo since we were planning to go for rabbits and turkey. What is your opinion on the Hunter Call of the Wild's rankings for each animal? What do you mean by rankings? Like, are you talking about the medals or are you talking about the, uh, class of them? Yes, there's two different dogs. There is the Retriever, and then there's been a Bloodhound DLC for a couple of years now. No, the Retriever does not track blood. It's only for retrieving. <laughs> no worries, uh, Yareed. No worries, man. <laughs> right now, we're just trying to find stuff for the dog to carry over. So we're hunting a variety of stuff, going for, like, turkeys and pheasant and rabbits as well. Just seeing, uh, seeing how good it does with all of them. So far, it's been doing pretty good. 
aside from like a little bit of derpiness with some of the uh, some of the animals that it can carry. About the metals of the animals. Oh, I like them. I think it's a good system. One of the things that makes uh, the Call of the Wild games unique. One to two. That's good, right? Yeah, I think that's good. I think one to two is a good estimate, if I'm not mistaken. Well, oh, there we go. Go get it, buddy. Yeah, true, Johnny. True, 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 true. 181, man. Pretty big rabbit. That was not a bad rabbit at all. Peasant tracks, man. We're finding a decent bit of stuff now. Nude, thank you for the three months, man. I think the next dog DLC should be a pointer or a flusher. Me too. That would be really nice, man. I think that would be a good next move for another dog. But I kind of hope they wait a while before they do another dog since it, it literally removed the possibility for a map or a great one with this update. Like, I would much rather have maps and great ones than dogs. So I kind of hope we don't get another dog for at least a year. Great one grinding for Whitetail. Nice Hunter Call of the Wild guy. That's awesome, man. Hope you're having fun with it. Hope you're having a good time. What map am I on? This right here is New England Mountains. Red or green ones have different variants like white tail racks and moose fur types. Uh, they only have one fur type for the red deer great one, but there's four different racks. Um, a couple of the antlers look very similar to the other two, though, so it can be tough to tell unless you have them all side by side. Sadly, the red deer great one has like the least amount of variety of any great one in the game. Oh, silly moose. We're not after you. Hey, Louisiana Outdoors. How's it going, man? Nice lane. Nice, dude. Hey, little buddy. I didn't miss that. You guys missed that. <laughs> Unfortunate no scope miss and out of ammo almost. Good job, buddy. There you go. Brought us a nice little pheasant. Duck aim. No, that was pheasant aim. That was pheasant aim. 100%. All right, let's go to a different map. We have not done any Rev on Thule this stream, and I have not hunted upland birds there, so I kind of feel like maybe going for some upland birds on Rev and then having the dog recover them. Uh, just do research on YouTube, Zach. Uh, spam in my chat's not going to help. I mean... I'll tell you one thing. You're going to do a lot better if you come up with unique ideas yourself. Best tip I can give you is just do do a search on YouTube on how to start a channel. That's what I did. Uh, let's see. Shotgun ammo purchasing simulator activate. Oh, yeah. This is what we love. This is the highlight of the show.
Good enough. No joke, I thought the dog was a uh, landed duck. <laughs> okay, retrieve. Bring him to me. Whoa, dude, the perk with the quick swimming is insane. Holy crap. Okay, that's the best trait that you can give your dog. That quick swimming is ridiculous. Now, go get another. Come on. I want to see that again. Go get another. Holy crap. Look at look at the zoom in pupper. Oh my gosh, that's so fast, man. <laughs> okay, guys. So, uh, 100% get the webbed pause trait at level 25. That's crazy quick. That is the fastest movement I've ever seen from old pupper. Oh my gosh, I can't aim. Oh man, we're doing great. There we go. Yeah, we got geese there. Canada geese. So those are probably brown hybrids. Not rare, in other words. Got a bunch more up there. Jeez. They're all over, man. You think the Great One Rack for Whitetail is good or bad? I love them. I think it's great. The only... There isn't a single Great One that I think is terrible. Like, I like all of them at least a little bit. Aside from Quad Paddle Moose, that's the only rack I think that is really bad. But that's just personal preference. Holy, they're just going everywhere. Where do I even look? They're all over. Oh, gosh. Stop your zigzagging. It's illegal. Because I said so. Oh, gosh. Missed it. I want to get more in the water, but they're being stubborn. They don't want to die above the water. That duck was crazy. Just like swooped me. Zeroing? That's not going to matter with shotguns. As far as I know, it doesn't matter with birdshot. At least that's what I've been told by, uh, by a lot of other players over the years. Yeah, like I'm having to aim in the same places at 75 as I would have at 25. Now, let's get our dog to go out there, though. Now we can see little zoomy paws. Look at her go. I love that. Yeah, that webbed paws is just cr such a crazy perk to get or crazy trait to get. Eight ninety five, not bad.
Yeah, same results at 25. There we go. Finally a hit on that. 885. Well, hello there. Got another one, buddy? Good job. 1,075. Getting lots of golds today. What gun is that? This is the 12-gauge uh, Cacciatore, and this right here is the 22 Hornet, which comes with the Mississippi DLC. Nice, Jay Frith. That's awesome. Okay. Getting more. Hey, Caleb, how's it going, man? We're just blasting some birdies right now. Testing out the new doggo. Seeing how it is. We're at level 28 on the dog already. Let's just get to 30. Let's just try to get the dog to 30. Thank God all of them except that goose. I'm not going to chase that goose though. It's ages away. Not ages away. What am I talking about? It's miles away. Kilometers away. Worlds away. It's so far away. Uh, let's go here. Let's go back to the goose setup. Uh, reset the page, Jericho. Do a refresh and it should be good. Moons away. Yes. Galaxies away. Oh, no worries, uh, Arkansas Razorbacks. No worries, man. Honestly, the more I'm thinking about it, I may just... I may just not do Roadier today. We may just stick with uh, the Waterfowl and trying to level this dog up to 30 so we can see its efficiency at level 30. Because that's probably a little bit more important right now. I can postpone the... Uh, What's it called? I can postpone the seven day grind a few days and then pick it up where it uh, was left off. Oh, geese, they're all over. All right, lay down. Hey, Colin, how's it going? What are we doing today? Testing out the brand new doggo in early access. We got the little, uh, little Labrador right here. Hanging out with us, having a good time, and retrieving all of our birds, of course. Out of remote range, where did I put it? Oh, it's over there. Oh, no. It's over there. All right, let's see, pupper. You got this. I believe in you. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's so good. I love that. I love that trait so much. The webbed pause trait that you unlock at level 25 makes your dog swim so quickly. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. 
That is so crazy how quick the doggo swims when you've got that webbed paws trait. Look at that. That's like two or three meters a second. The fastest dog on Revon Tuli. Thank you. Thank you, pupper. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, I went into the no shooty state. Feels bad, man. And dock problems. Let's go. Okay. Go over here. That'll be better. Um, I think so, Jericho. From what I've heard. Jaxie said a while back on one of the EW streams that the dogs, and this was obviously just Bloodhound at the time, but I assume it's the same for the labs. Um, but apparently, they will spook off all small game and birds, but they will not spook off big game. Nice. Gonna wait for a few more to land. Good doggy. Another little ducky for us. So currently level 28, 75% of the way to 29. And level 14 to 15 in retrieving. Ah, I missed that easy shot. Missed all of those easy shots, too. You hit the dock again? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I definitely need to change this uh, setup location. This is pretty bad. If it's going to consistently get hung up, I cannot keep my setup here. I think I can pick everything up. Maybe not, though. Well, we'll find out soon. A gold female tufted. That's cool. Love to see it. Yeah, I don't got enough room for it. Okay. Okay, well, we're going to have to do something then. We're going to have to go grab our collar and then swap the loadout so that I can pick everything up. I don't know, uh, Tyrek, it's hard to say. Actually, I can just take it out like that. But it's still on the ground, so I do need to grab it, actually. Because we need to move that entire goose setup. It's just not in a good spot at all. Okay, much, 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 much better. Nice, Star Wars for life. That's awesome, man. Wait, never mind. I just read the end. That's not good. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. It's awesome that you found them, but that sucks that it crashed. I didn't read like the the full uh, the full thing before I replied. Oof, man. That sucks. That sucks a lot. What's my best trophy? My favorite would probably be... Albino Diamond Big Rack Red Deer. I'd say that's my favorite. It's like, I don't really call it 
the best because best is subjective. Everybody's going to have a different opinion on what best is. But that's definitely my favorite. Okay, we got all those. Get out of here, little tufted duckies. Inventory capacity reached. Ain't no way. Ain't no way, man. I mean, I suppose I could get rid of that. That'll make it easier. I wish I could just hold E down and have it like just keep grabbing them, but I have to like spam it. Okay, we got them all. Beautiful. Let's move this around now. So I'm thinking we go here instead. This looks like it would be a good area. Uh, don't mind that. That that didn't happen. Hey, RC. Hey, Jack. Does the dog track as well? No, it doesn't. No tracking for the dog. Just retrieving. Yeah, this doesn't look too bad over here. We'll try it. We'll see how this works. Dog leveled up to level 30. Oh my gosh. Well, we did it, guys. Level 30 on the dog. We still need to hit level 15 on retrieving, though. Retrieves at longer distances and is less burdened by carrying harvests. Boom. We did it. Max level dog in... Two hours and 40 minutes of playing with the dog, so you can do it really quickly. If you're, like, hunting the whole time, it happens pretty quick. Canada goose, bean goose, and gray light geese. There we go. Actually, I don't need all those. There we go. Oh, 
Holy. There's so many. So many decoys. Okay, we got that done. Now, do a quick little main menu to get the geese to stop being spooked, and then we'll get things going with them. Does PS4 not have those duck blinds? No, it does. You have to buy the duck and cover DLC. Okay. All right, let's turn this on for gray legs. Lots of gray leg geese here. Love to see it, man. There's way too many to spot. Like, there's no way I'm going to spot all these. Let's let them do their thing. Let them do their thing. What is rare for black bear? Cinnamon, blonde, and brown. Where am I at on the map? Right here. Bottom left. It's a pretty good area. Come on, land. Land before this one notices that we're here. Okay, here we go. Okay, we hit that. How many kills is that? Wait, none of them have died yet. Oh man, 12 gauge does not do good on geese. That's unfortunate. Am I gonna have to break out the 10 gauge? I might have to break out the 10 gauge. That did not go how I thought it would. Also... To probably move this, actually. I don't like how, uh... How far away they're landing. Try that there. Let's see. Ten gauge, ten gauge. Where's ten gauge? There's ten gauge. Perfect. Oh yeah, I forgot about that uh back east baseball. Let's see. I'll turn the alert box back on. I, I completely forgot to turn it back on. So I have no clue if it's fixed. We'll know if we see random stuff popping up. Holy crap. That is insanity. That is beautiful. 
That is beautiful right there. Oh my gosh, that wood goes so good with it. That is a beautiful combination right there. Holy crap, man. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, a couple of them came back. Too bad. Uh, they're not really close enough for the dog to... Actually, yeah. I was going to say they're not far enough away for the dog to grab them, but I guess they were. What's up, little dude? You just hopping and skipping? Our dog definitely did not skip leg day. That's for sure. No skipping of the leg day. Nah, it was just way farther away than I should have uh, tried to shoot at Johnny. Way farther away than what the 10 gauge can typically do. It's really strange. Like, uh, the 12 gauge seems to have better range than the 10 gauge. But it's got less power, so like I still think the 10 gauge is going to be better for geese. We'll have to see. Um, I believe that would be max weight Bantang. Uh, yeah, 800 kgs I think is max weight for Bantang. If I'm not mistaken, I believe that that is it. Come on, little goosies. You guys take a long time just up in the air. Um, it boosts the, what's it called? The bond. It just boosts the bond. That's it, uh, Gwape. It just boosts the bond of the, uh, of the dog. Okay, yeah, 10 gauge is going to be the play. 10 gauge is the play. 100% 10 gauge. That is the first ones that we've dropped today. We were not able to drop the other ones with the 12 gauge. The no sight is kind of rough though. Having no sight is kind of rough. Where's our dog? Um, what are you doing out there, buddy? Uh, come back, Aquaman. <laughs> They're right here. <laughs> Dude, they're right there. You can get them. I believe in you. <laughs> Come on. You got to know they're there, right? All right. All right, then. Oh, man. Can I even walk out to that? No, I can't get to them and the dog won't grab it. No. Dude, what are you doing? They're right there. <laughs> I think those geese are bugged. I think they might be bugged. Because they're not floating over. They should be floating over. I think they're bugged. Look at them. They're just frozen. Oh, dude, they're 100% bugged. Yeah, we've got bugged geese. I think that's why he can't find them. Those geese are definitely bugged, man. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Huh. 
All right, well, buddy, come back here and uh, sit down, I guess. Yeah, still has less range than the 12 gauge. Unfortunate. Nice snipes. That's pretty crazy, man. Gosh. It's floating now. What the? That's so weird. It's now floating. What about these? Also, where's this birdshot hitting? I feel like it's hitting low. That's hitting low for sure. Yeah, that's hitting low. Huh. Uh, that was hitting way lower than where the, the bead is. And that's way less than 50 meters. Same top of that. Now we'll aim edge of the water. Yeah, when I aim edge of water, it's hitting low. That's weird. Very, very weird. Almost as weird as this. What is this right here? What is it? Why is there tracks here? It's piling up blood from those. Yeah, they're bugged. They, they are definitely bugged. We're going to have to main menu, I think. Hey, Danny, how's it going? Oh, that's good. Uh, Gwaip, that's good. I might have to consider doing that then. You know, honestly, guys, I think that's really all that I can uh, handle right now for bird hunting. The dog is pretty cool, but it doesn't make me uh, stay interested in bird hunting for any longer than I could previously. So we're probably going to go ahead and jump off. I need to get some other stuff done for content anyway. But I appreciate each and every one of you dropping by. We got uh, two hours worth of dog gameplay, leveled it up to level 30, and got to test out some of the traits to their uh, fullest effect. And I can officially say now, after playing for three hours with the dogs in total, uh, it is going to help speed up the process of claiming your geese and your ducks and stuff. I wouldn't say it's any type of benefit for rabbit hunting or turkey hunting or upland bird hunting because you're going to be running around when you go for those anyway but for waterfowl it's very useful the only things we ran into is some slight pathing issues a little bit of uh problems with like the geese bugging out but that's the geese bugging out that's a goose thing not a dog thing but overall yes the dog is useful for uh Waterfowl hunting. It's very useful for waterfowl hunting. It moves really quick in the water with the webbed feet perk or trait. And uh, it, it is very, very good at making it super efficient to get a bunch of uh, waterfowl down. So if you enjoy lots and lots of bird hunting, this will probably be a good DLC for you. If you don't hunt birds a lot, then it's probably not going to be of much use to you. <laughs> Smoked it. But thank you all. We'll be back with another stream either later today or in a couple of days. Peace.